When New York Sunworks designed the curriculum for the Greenhouse Project Labs, we made sure to incorporate science standards all students need to know. However, we made it really fun and truly meaningful to each student. If you came into a Greenhouse Project Lab, you might look around and think kids were just playing around and farming. You might not realize students are actually using tools, technology, and 21st century skills. I love the ladybugs and I love holding them. We have ladybugs because um, there is aphids. I love the ladybugs because they eat the aphids. So in my classroom it's a really unique experience because the children actually uh, get to follow a plant from the beginning all the way to the end, from seed germination to harvesting. I can see the, the light in their eyes when they come into my classroom, they all know the class. <laughs> the the hands-on experience is really just unparalleled to anything anyone can really say in any uh, classroom. The fish need clean water. Let's just say if you were a fish, you wouldn't want you to swim in your own poop and other people's poop. When they like come jumping out to get the food, it like they like open their mouth and it's like kind of cool and it scares you a little, but in a fun way. When I am working on the energy bike, I can convert my own energy into electricity, and I think that it's really cool. My students are working really towards the technology and engineering aspect. They are not only designing their own systems, but they're building them based off of the systems in our own greenhouse. So students have to do research into how the system works, what works best, how other people have done it. The students then build their systems and install them into each teacher's classroom. to put our own creative spin on it and we built like a sparkly top and we got to pick our own fish and rocks which was really fun with putting science as well as your own creatistic like look on it. So after a decade of teaching this project has been so invigorating, so energizing to get to walk into a classroom in an urban setting and farm with your kids to be able to pollinate right then and there to harvest, to cook, it's been a lot of fun. Much of what we do is connected to the future on a global scale. For example, vine crops and aquaponics teach kids the same ways to grow food. The rainwater catchment system teaches us solutions to deal with water problems. You may not realize it, but this is all connected. Teachers across the country are trying to figure out how to get students to understand and really care about complex concepts like sustainability and climate change. We need to teach people about being green and how to save the world. So the greenhouse is like a shrine for all green things and we're learning from this place. So yeah, we're learning. Good.